Hey, what's up, guys? It's Spawn FX. I'm giving you a tutorial on how to get the best quality for HD gaming. Um, in this case, it's mostly for Gears of War, um, both Xbox and PC, Gears of War 2, and most probably Gears of War 3, um, Call of Duty, and Halo. Um, it's called FFD Show, it's a video codec. Video codecs are um, basically codes that your computer reads to play certain types of videos or. Um, encode it you know just make like make a video um such as you know avi wmv for most people mp4 um f lv all that kind of stuff um but yeah so let's get started first thing you want to want to do is um if you're if you're running a 64-bit system you're gonna have to get a 32-bit um editing program such as sony vegas um you know camtasia studio works with this as well um for some odd reason, my computer, you know, I couldn't download the newest versions of Vegas and have it at 32-bit. Um, I don't know why, so I downloaded Vegas 8, and it works perfectly fine. But, so you're going to want to download that, install it. I'm sure you can find a tutorial on YouTube on how to get that for free. Hell, I'll even post one in the description. Um, so, yeah. So you get that program, and after that, you're going to want to open your internet browser and search a codec pack and it's called the K Lite codec and it's this one right here I'll put the link in the description and you're going to want to download the full version yes and that is done already alright and then after you get it done doing that, you're going to want to search FFD D show codec. And let's see, go to that. Nope, let's not go to that one. Let's go to this one. And hopefully this one works. Last time it did not work. Aha. Okay. Finally. Okay. So after that's done, you go to where you saved it. I saved it in my downloads. And you're going to want to install the codec pack, the K Lite. And hit next. Hit advanced. Um, hit next again. Next. Make sure you enable this internal decoder for H.264 video. Hit next. And check the um, Windows Media Player. Do not check the Media Player Classic. Hit next. And then uh, you're going to want to select all video and select all audio. And then hit next. 2.0 stereo, 2.0 whatever. Hit next. And then install. Shouldn't take long at all. Okay, um, I'm not going to restart my computer. Um, okay, after that's done, you're going to want to install the FFD Show codec. Again, this shouldn't take long either. You want to um, accept this, but then decline every single one of these they're all just stupid things that you don't want and no decline alright so now it's downloading the codec And it's done. So I hit finish. And of course, this thing pops up all the time. I get it. You're great. Thanks for giving me your product. All right. So after that's done, open up your uh, video editing software program. My case is Sony Vegas 8. No. All right. And then import a clip, whatever you want doesn't matter to me 
I just made this video. In fact, it's on YouTube. So I'll just post a little bit of this. I guess I guess I can video I can give you guys some tips on my quality here. Um, if you're using Vegas, you go to your video effects tab and you drag in sharpen. Uh, you just drag in reset to none, and then you go to color corrector secondary, and then drag in studio RGB to computer RGB, and then you go to brightness and contrast, and then you do uh, you drag down brighter and more contrast in there and it, it's pretty good quality um, alright so after that's done you go to render as and you're gonna want to first thing go down to AVI went video for Windows and then on this tab here you're gonna want to go to default template uncompressed hit custom set this to best video um, I record at 60 frames a second um, at 1680 by 1050, 1050, whatever. Um, but you're gonna want to uh, ex export it to 1280 by 720 for YouTube. Um, if you if you record at 30, you know, type in 30 up here. <coughs> but I do 60 because my computer can handle it and. Um, I know it's just good quality. Make sure this is at none progressive scan. Pixel aspect ratio is set to one. And then for video format, you're going to want to go to FFD show, the c codec pack that you just downloaded. And then you click that and hit configure. For the um, encoder up here, you're going to go to H.264. For your source, you're going to do go to AVC1. And then on for the mode, you're going to want to go to one pass quantizer. Um, and then you want to set your quantizer. The less the quantizer is, the better the quality, but the bigger the file size. I would recommend putting it at 30, um, but I put it at 25. Um, if you go below that, I believe we're going to have to, um, you're going to get some audio problems and some syncing problems with your video. I don't know. That's just my case. I don't know if that's would be for you guys. Um, but yeah. So after that's done, make sure this is set to 30. Your um, maximum RDR. Come on, hit 30. Uh, whatever. And make sure this is at 1. I'll set this later. <laughs> um, and yeah. Hit apply and hit OK. And then make sure your audio is set at 44, 100, 16, and stereo. And it's at PCM uncompressed. All right, and then you can name it whatever. I already saved it as one, so I'm not going to. And you hit OK. And then you render it. I'm going to rename this test and then save. I don't know how long this is going to take, but uh, I'll fast forward the video. Alright, so after that's done, you know, I can click to open it. And there you have it. very beast quality um, not very large file size um, so yeah um, thanks for watching um, I guess I should uh, thank xpy for this he gave me a message over YouTube I asked him how to do it because his quality is really good he has some great videos on his page you can go check his page out I guess <coughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs>
I subscribe to him because I'm a follower like that. Um, you know, just subscribe to him. Um, ask him some questions if you want. He helped me out. So, uh, yeah, thanks, bye. Um, and again, thanks for watching. Hope this helped out.